I just need to talk to Jeremy Beckett, please. He has the right to a phone call. It's the law. Hello? Hello? Damn it. Caitlin, he's in the hospital full of cops, all right? He's gonna be fine. Why us? What does this person want? If those were really beacon guard cameras, then Dana and Claire would know the truth about Jeremy and we'd all be in jail right now. Would we? It was her daughter who pulled the trigger. Taylor told me that before she disappeared, she discovered that someone hijacked Beacon Guard to spy on a select group of people. How would she even figure that out? Taylor created Beacon Guard after her father was murdered. Nobody knows how the system works better than she does. Whoever hijacked Beacon Guard tried to kill Taylor. That's why she left. So she knew somebody was watching us? No, she knew people were being watched, but she didn't know who they were or why. We don't know the why, but now we know who we are. Minus the two that never showed up tonight. There were seven chairs and five of us. Why wouldn't you tell us about this? The scoreboard, the rat in my trunk, Caitlin getting hit by a car. Are we saying that this wasn't Dana poking us until we cracked? I'd rather believe it's Dana than this professor creep. I think there's someone in there. I was out here yesterday with Taylor. We did not leave the lights on when we left. Maybe it's Taylor. Maybe she's back from Riverwell. <laughs> 